country will be of interest to you. There are a lot of Nigerians in that country, country in Europe that Nigeria export to. Nigeria export a lot to that country. It's one of the, the in fact, this country I'm about to talk about, the export of this country alone is more than the whole of Africa put together. By the way, the country in question is not up to 20 million people, but the, the Nigeria. Yeah, welcome to DBA TV, where we discuss everything about international trade. And my name is Delia Imibo. I'm your expert doctor. Today, we'll continue our conversation on the countries you can consider to ship your goods, a country you can consider to export your product. And the reason why we've been looking at the country that Nigeria exported to last year is to give you an idea of the country you can export to also. So today, for example, we are looking at Mali and a couple of other countries um, that Nigeria exported to. And the question you should be asking yourself is, do you have someone in this country? Do you have a rep in this country? Do you have access to the product that is being shipped to this country? Then why not consider this? If you have a rep in that country, you have someone you can work with in that country, you have access to this product that are produced in Nigeria, you don't need to be manufacturer of the product, by the way. You can be the distributor and work with the people producing. In some cases, they can even produce for you in your brand. So the question I'm asking you today is, why are you not considering exporting to these countries like Mali? So let's look at Mali. Nigeria export to Mali is about $15.2 million. And Nigeria export various plastic and rubber slippers. Plastic and rubber slippers, rubber hose, plastic wash and basin, wash and basin, plastic wash and basin, plastic bucket, plastic spoon, plastic cooler, plastic cup, plastic water can, <laughs> monosodium glutamate. You know that already. That's one of the seasoning. Monosodium glutamate, Maggi seasoning, Maggi chicken, chicken uh, Maggi poulet, uh, persil uh, masse, Maggi chicken sauce, a powder, hair attachment, Rubber slippers, diapers, diapers, cut tad tobacco. So we have tobacco and bedroom slippers, baby and adult diapers, baby and adult diapers. These are the items that Nigeria currently exports to Mali. Let's look at other countries that Nigeria exports to. We have Mauritania. Nigeria shipment Mauritania is very, very small. What does Nigeria export to Mauritania, by the way? Nigeria Mauritania, the quantity is small, but the volume is large. Major item of Nigeria export to Mauritania is tobacco. $1.5 million. Out of about $1.6 million, $1.5 million is tobacco. Then we have air relaxers and shampoo. Air relaxer and shampoo. How about Mauritius? Mauritius is very small. It's just a, a 33 cl amber bottle. A 33 cl amber bottle. That is the only product that Nigeria exports to Mauritius. So Nigeria export to Mauritius is very, very small. 33 cl is about ten eleven thousand dollars. 33 cl amber bottle. What else? Which other country does Nigeria export to last year? Nigeria export to another interesting country last year called. Mexico, Mexico, Mexico. $51 million in Mexico. I guess you said probably a lot of um, hibiscus flour to Mexico. Hibiscus flour. But you know, there was a time we had issues with hibiscus flour and the ban again is hibiscus flour export to Mexico. Uh, uh, it's supposed to have resumed now, but unfortunately, it's like the people who are exporting to Mexico, a number of them are looking for other market already. So we still have hibiscus flour export to Mexico, but very small. Then we have cocoa powder, we have urea, we have whole sesame seed, Nigerian premium sorted sesame seed, we have pet flakes, we have pet plastic flakes, we have sesame seed and zinc ingot. How about Morocco? Another very interesting destination of Nigerian export. Morocco, $11 million. That's the value of Nigeria export to Morocco. We have which brand? What do we export to Morocco? Wheat pellet, 
recycle polypropylene black bag, polypropylene bag, recycle. Pet flakes, unwashed. Nigerian ginger, Nigeria dry split ginger, hibiscus flour, dark bronze tinted glass. You know, I've been telling you about these tinted glasses. These are glasses that are used for buildings, some of them for windows, some of them for uh, staircase. They are used for building. You see the dark blue or uh, dark bronze, uh, dark gray. They are all tinted reflective glasses. They are all for building. If you have heard them in the previous video, I forgot to mention it. They are all for buildings, dark blue and bronze. So this, all these glasses are produced in Nigeria. We have the clear glass, 5 mm clear glass, 5 mm dark reflexive glass, 6 mm clear glass. Then we have African cashew nut and cashew kernel exported to where? Morocco. African cashew nut and cashew kernel exported to Morocco. Where else does Nigeria export to? Apart from Morocco, we also have Mozambique, but the shipment of Mozambique is very, very small. Nigeria shipment in Mozambique is quantity, uh, number of items is small, but urea is a major export of Mozambique. About 90% of Nigeria's in Mozambique is urea, and that's um, um, granular urea. Out of about $50 million export, about 15.4, 15.5 million, 15.4 is just urea. The remaining dark gray tinted blue reflexive glass, fiber mix, float glass, soya beans meal. Then Namibia, Namibia is very small, just one product, one set of product, cream, cosmetic generally, $52,000. 50, cosmetic generally. Nigeria also export to Nepal, almost a million dollars, but it's mainly cashew nut and cashew kernel. Mainly cashew nut and cashew kernel. Now, the next country will be of interest to you. There are a lot of Nigerians in that country. It's a major uh, 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 country in Europe that Nigeria export to. Nigeria export a lot to that country. It's one of the, the, in fact, this country I'm about to talk about, the export of this country alone is more than the whole of Africa put together. By the way, the country in question is not up to 20 million people. But the, the Nigeria export to this particular country is about $260 million. What country am I talking about? The Netherlands. The Dutch. The Netherlands. <laughs> or the Holland. The Netherlands. Nigeria export yam flour, elubo, to Netherlands. Nigeria export expression air extension to Netherlands. Nigeria export processed rubber to Netherlands. Nigeria export star lega beer. Gulda to Netherlands. Nigeria export stainless steel to Netherlands. Nigeria export copper catalyst, soya lecithin, soft drink, malta Guinness, and Fanta to Netherlands. Nigeria export soft drink like Schweppes to Netherlands. Nigeria export tiger nuts to Netherlands, raw tiger nuts, raw cocoa beans to Netherlands. Nigeria export pure prime press Nigeria cocoa butter to Netherlands. Nigeria export Processed shrimps to Netherlands. Nigeria export processed seafood like crumbs, I mean, like crabs, shrimps, prawns. Nigeria export polyester fiber to Netherlands, pet plastic bottles, palm wine to Netherlands. Nigeria export non alcoholic drinks, white sesame seed to Netherlands. Nigeria export raw cocoa beans to Netherlands. Nigeria export Cocoa cake and cocoa liqueur to Netherlands. Foodstuffs, beverages, close up. Close up. <laughs> close up to Netherlands. Cashew kernel, alcoholic drinks, uh, natural rubber, Malta Guinness, Maltina, Maggi seasoning, no seasoning, indomitable indomie, <laughs> indomie chicken. <laughs> Indomie chicken to Netherlands, air extension, tura soap and black soap, golden moon, hair attachment, gulda, star bottle are all expressed in Netherlands, fermented cocoa beans, golden moon, malt drink, dry pepper, frozen shrimps, frozen seafood, Fanta, pet bottles, Guinness, stout, maltina, are all exported to Netherlands. Costa, 
palm, dry fermented raw cocoa beans are all spread to Netherlands. All these are so when you think of regular, even Dudu Osu is spread to Netherlands. With sesame seed, if we think of regular Nigerian food item, are all referred to Netherlands. Before I close, let me remind you the goal of this series of seminar of, of sessions rather on DPA TV talking to you about export is that through this you will know country that import from Nigeria, the item they import, the we show the item you can export to that country. So if you have a friend, a relative, or anyone you can work with in that country, you can get Eureka Park to be able to learn about to work with your partner. At the destination, we have a pack that trains and show you videos and books and material and manner on how to do that. Now, with that, you can easily start exporting to this country because you now know that our products are acceptable to them. The quality is acceptable. The, 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 there are buyers for those products. There are consumers of those products in those countries. That means these are products you can consider for export. I believe this video has been of immense benefit to you. Like the video, share with your friends. Don't remember to click on the notification bell. Drop a comment in the comment section. Let us know if there are countries you want to talk about that you are interested in shipping to and you want to know what does Nigeria export to those countries. Thank you very much for stopping by again. My name is Redela Imibo, and I'm your export doctor. I'm signing out. Bye-bye. See you in the next video. Bye for now.